The other big story tonight, rape survivors can now break their leases without paying costly termination fees under a new law that goes into effect tonight. Team 12's Bianca Bona joins us live from the Alert Center with the steps that they can take now to keep from having to relive that attack. Bianca. Mark Haribe, imagine enduring sexual abuse inside your home and then being told you can't move unless you pay a steep fine. Well, that's actually happened to a number of people here in Arizona, but a new law that's now in effect will prevent that from ever happening again. Someone experiences sexual violence every 98 seconds. The numbers are staggering. 60 to 80 percent of sexual assault survivors actually know their perpetrator. In many of those cases, sexual assault survivors attacked in their own home. We even know uh, of, of one such case that happened uh, locally here in Maricopa County where she was kept for days at a time in her apartment at the hands of her perpetrator. Up until now, those sexually assaulted in a rented home could not break their lease without paying hefty fines. And that could have a lot of implications for feeling safe if the perpetrator was not found. Um, if it happened in their home, now that person knows where they live. So talk about not feeling safe in their own home. A living nightmare being stuck in the place where the assault happened, forced to relive the violence every day. Their emotional ability to function in daily life um, isn't there. But now, thanks to a new Arizona law, rape survivors have a way out. I think victims in general are uh, are suffering enough. Survivors can submit a police report or order of protection to their landlord and walk away from their apartment, no questions asked. At the end of the day, it's a matter of fairness and safety. And Arizona already has a law in the books allowing for domestic violence survivors to do the same thing. If you or someone you know has experienced sexual assault, you can find details for trauma healing centers on our website, 12news.com. We're live in the Alert Center. Bianca Bono, 12 News at 10. Bianca, thanks. Well